This is what is so great about this, is how, what they did in here. Just how cool are those beams? Hey guys, welcome back. It's Bo Brotherton with BetterTogetherLife.com. Trying to teach y'all how to swim upstream with us and challenge the status quo and just do things that are weird. I actually found something that I wanted to share with y'all. I know that a lot of y'all are in the homesteading realm and uh, some of y'all came for because you want to be able to see us completely do something nuts and, and live in a shed. Shed, shed, not shit. Live in a shed, shed house, shed. But you're interested in this shed house living thing. I found an old clip of me doing a quick little tour of that main house that everybody loves. So I'll show it over here. This is a video that really did kickstart our YouTube channel. People saying, hey, it was great. I really love being able to see this. Can I get more information about it? But your kids were kind of loud. Yes. So let me share this little clip of me just walking around with my camera. It's the camera is kind of shaky and the video is kind of grainy. But anyway, check it out and I'll come back to the end. Okay, so this is the one that we love the most. It is absolutely gorgeous in here. You can just see the detail. It is just beautiful. So all they did all these nice beams. Those are just facades, but still, still pretty amazing. And then the kitchen is super cool. It's tight, but it's still functional. Little bitty, you still have a, an oven, electric range, I guess. And then the loft, where the kids are, is at just perfect. I mean, all three of them, all three of our kids could easily sleep up here or play up here. Be really nice. You have two right up there. And another one on the other side and it's nice and safe and I think those doors close down there and I'll show you down there. Nice fan. Yep. These two doors shut in case you want them private or whatever. And then there's a little utility thing right here. That's probably washer and dryer hookup. Then you have there's no sink there. I guess that'll happen at some point. So this is a one bedroom with a loft. But what they were able to do is to fit a really nice little bedroom with an office, with a decent closet space. I guess that's another utility thing. Oh, up here you have the central air and heat. So I guess that's taking place in the other loft. And then you have your own bathroom. So an actual master bathroom in here. Super cool little medicine cabinet with a mirror. It's really nice. So you could have something like right here could have a queen size bed, Murphy bed or something, with actually a lot, just, it's a ton of headspace in here, a ton. So the second loft is being taken up by the central air and heat. So really cool, really cool. They have this little thing, little nook right here. I wonder, I wonder if you remove this, if you would have more space. That would be cool to know. A second door right there. And then of course, this is what is so great about this, is how, what they did in here. Just how cool are those beams? Guys, I hope that you enjoyed that. And I want to keep this conversation going. So I'm going to post the video and some of the photos over at our new Facebook group, Shed to House. 
we've realized that there is a community, a growing community of people that want to be able to find out more information about this movement. And so come over to there and be able to ask your questions. Come over there to get involved with a community that has already done it. We haven't done this yet. We're still in the process. Uh, we're, we're working on our next video to be able to do the, the, the floor plan for our house. But there are people that are already living this life now that you can get on this group and you can learn from them. So go check it out and, and, and ask your questions. Also, if you've already done this, please go and, and share your knowledge over there. This is something that I wanna get away from. I just want it to kind of become its own organic community to be able to help this out. So Shed to House Facebook group. Okay, guys, thanks again, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye.